Well, they are only in their mid 20s, but three young men are doing something big in downtown Minneapolis. I got the chance to talk with the entrepreneurs who are about to take over a Nicolette Mall four story space. It ties Minneapolis. They are almost ready to party, but. Also, wanted to clarify we're not a bar, <laughs> we're a community. A community that's come together in a unique way. It all started when they came together. From Big Lake and St. Paul, they met after college, and they just clicked. He grew up on a totally different plane than I did, and he grew up on a totally different plane than I did, but we can, obviously we're best friends now, we can come together. Together, they planned Gene's 23rd birthday. The event was a success. And soon, they were being hired to professionally host events. We've met so many people just by being friendly and welcoming, where it's skyrocketed, you know, our careers. Instead of exclusive events, they host inclusive events. Every single person that comes in, into this door, I want to be your best friend. We, we want to be your best friend. We want everybody to be as close-knit as possible. This is their newest venture. They've taken over this four-story Nicolette Mall space with the help of investors like Levi. And I really saw like, like, I mean, they're beyond potential. Like they've really built something special. How people uh, come to them, I mean, they're just so easy to walk up to and talk to and you just immediately feel connected to them. And there will be plenty of places to connect. Ties will have a food court with a meatball shop and pizza options. They'll have pop-up art galleries and an Instagram photo op room, several bars, and when things thaw, acclaimed chef Justin Sutherland will open a new restaurant on the rooftop. But they're not just tying concepts together. This mission goes deeper. Obviously, we went through a lot of stuff, what happened with George Floyd, the social unrest and everything like that. Uh, we want to kind of be a place for healing, um, somewhere that everybody can come in here and get to understand each other. Um, that they couldn't do anywhere else. They believe the only way to truly integrate this city is to not only work together, but to play together. But we want to be able to have everybody be under the same roof and have fun with different different groups of people, mm -hmm. walks of life. And to be honest, it's, it's on all of us to work together to bring back, you know, unity um, within our community. So they are doing just that. Three friends tying one city together. And that's what people need to see is that there are places in Minnesota that aren't saying that you have to be here and you have to be here. It's everybody can be in one spot all together. It ties. It ties. It ties. It ties. It ties. It ties. And Mike, it's really cool because they said no matter people's age, their background, they just want everybody to come together and just talk, relax, have fun. That, that's the key, right? Everybody needs to, to at least listen to everybody else, even if you don't necessarily agree with whatever they're talking about. It'd be sports, who, who, what team to follow, Vikings or Packers, or something far more important. Yeah. Listening is the key. Yes, and heads up to anyone who's wondering, they're going to open any day now. They're just getting the final touches, and it's right on Nicolette Mall, not far from our studio. That's right.